September 10th is the peak of hurricane season. Does that peak your interest? The peak means is when we've seen the most tropical cyclones and hurricanes over 100 years of data. Why September 10th? It all comes down to science. In September, atmospheric conditions are prime for storm formation. We have warm ocean waters, which provide fuel for storms, high humidity, and lower wind shear, which limits storm formation. Like Goldilocks and the Three Bears, conditions are just right more often in September. Where do these storms get started? Let's take a trip from Georgia to the tropics. We're headed to the Intertropical Convergence Zone, also called the main development region in the tropical Atlantic, where seedlings of hurricanes live. These seedlings are called tropical waves, basically clusters of storms moving west over warm waters, growing and starting to rotate. It can become a tropical depression, and if the water stays warm and wind shear stays low, a tropical storm or hurricane grows. September is prime time in this region with waves moving off the coast of Africa, sometimes every couple of days. We also see storms forming in the Western Caribbean, which can later threaten the Gulf. Remember, when the ocean waters are warm and the wind shear is low, storm can intensify quickly. That's why you should stay up to date watching the path and potential impacts for landfall.